Hi and welcome to simplysegoober.com. In this session we're going to look at the fourth element Sub Zero Jacket. Let's take a closer look. The Sub Zero Jacket is designed to be worn in conjunction with fourth element's existing base layers such as the Arctic or Thermocline uh, garments. It provides waterproof and windproof features uh, which obviously the existing base layers don't. It's designed specifically to be worn underneath a membrane or a trilaminate dry suit and Features on the jacket are specifically designed for that. As we have a look around the jacket, you can see on the cuffs, have a nice, easy grab Velcro, just to give a bit of extra tightness around the cuffs, so when you put your dry suit on, it doesn't ride up your arm. And also have a number of vents, which are specifically placed for dumps. On the cuff, you have a couple of just vent holes there just so that the air doesn't get trapped and caught up against the dump itself. And as we go up the arm you can see we have a big vented area which is great for allowing the air out of your shoulder dumps. Across the shoulders we have a slightly heavier duty material just to prevent any wear on the shoulders. It also gives you extra padding as well. The neck has been cut short just so you can have your neck seal on against your skin so it's not going to prevent any ceilings and not going to get any water in through there and a nice little feature on the zip you just got a little lip over section so when the zip is all the way up it's not rubbing on, on the seal itself on the inside of the jacket you've got a nice fleece lined layer which is going to give you good thermal properties keep you nice and warm on the bottom of the jacket you've got a couple of straps which pass underneath the crotch and Again, help to prevent the jacket from riding up when you put your dry suit on and obviously whilst in use as well. So it's a great extra thermal protection and also providing water and windproof features.